All right, so this is gonna be a different kind of video. We're gonna be working in Dwarf Fortress. I already did one where I failed to build stairs. Complete failure, it was amazing. So now I've started a new outpost, same world, different place. We're going to be setting out, oh, I'll just read it. You've arrived after journeying from the mountain homes into the forbidding wilderness beyond, your harsh trek has finally ended. Your party of seven is to make an outpost for the glory of all Akamlakat. There are almost no supplies left, but with stout labor comes sustenance, whether by bolt, plow, or hook, provide for your dwarves. You're expecting supply carrying just before winter entombs you, but it is spring now. Enough time to delve, uh, uh, to delve secure lodgings ere the Sasquatches get hungry. And we, yeah, there are probably Sasquatches and they're probably hungry. A new chapter of Dwarven history begins here at this place, Zon Zondrum Tar, Helm's Castle. Oh, it's cool name, Strike the Earth. So, oh, God, stop, 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 stop. All right, so we're gonna, uh, we get, we're gonna have to, let's first let's kind of get a look at where we're at here. All right, so this is our area. It looks like it's, we're in the dead of winter or something. I don't know, it's all snow covered. Ooh, there's a little river here, coastline here, some stuff off the water. So, elevation. So we're about like two above the ground and then, yeah. So our first concern is gonna be shelter and yeah, we're gonna want shelter and getting our people underground into safety. Um, getting a food source going, probably chopping some wood and getting some supplies down. So what I'm going to do is a couple of things. Let's get some, uh, let's get a stockpile going. Now in the tutorial, it just tells you about everything in the stockpile and I guess you can do that. I'd like to kind of specialize and just like put stock stuff in different. So this stockpile is gonna be mainly reserved for wood. I think I'm just gonna put wood here and I'll put wood up here because I'm gonna chop a bunch of stuff. And then eventually once I build, get build downward, I will then probably transfer that wood down, downstairs. But for just a start, this is gonna be fine for right now. So yeah, I'm gonna accept this. We're gonna make it, um, yeah, I just put wood. That'll be fine. Wood stockpile number one. Okay, anyway. All right, so there's that. We want to be a wood stockpile and we're good. All right. So they should start putting the wood there. I'm going to go ahead and then queue up a bunch of stuff to cut. Just do that. That gives us, should give us plenty of wood. And now I'm going to go ahead and start building stairs downwards. I'm probably gonna go like two levels down and then start building. That way. So we'll just start. Yeah, I think we'll just start here. And then we're gonna go down. Stairs. And then I'm gonna go again. Go down. Stairs. Then, I think I'm gonna build this way. Get that going, and then we'll build a central chamber here. This will be kind of like an entryway. Off of this, I want to build two ways off of that. And that'll we'll get me started. I do think I'm gonna do bedrooms, so.
let's just get that going. That'll be get that'll be a good start. And let me go for labor because I'm gonna add one more miner. Because the star should only have one. Um, my Mason. Um, Mason. Well, I, I actually wanted to look at them. Uh, let me look at them. I mean, I've added them, but let's see. You're my Mason. Are you decent at mining? Skills. Proficient miner, stone cutter, adequate stone carver, novice engraver. What skills do you have? Just that. Uh, we'll probably move into stone cutting once we kind of get things situated. But for right now, they're probably more useful to be mining. Um, and I'll give him a nickname. Thob Allenbrook. You'll be from now ever known as Papa Gray. Hopefully you don't die, Papa Gray. She's seven years old, I mean it's a woman. Whatever. Um and let's see here. I'll pick somebody else. You our planter. You will be dude bro. I'm pulling these names from the Discord. Just I'm not much of a decision maker. Me me neither, dude bro. Me neither. That they are in my hands. We got dude bro, Riggle Duck Planter. And we have here, where's the other one? Papa Gray, Alan Brook. Alan Baumrick Mason, Bob, whatever. Okay. All right, so there's that. And there's so much stuff going on in this game. I think we're good to just let it, I'm gonna unpause and let it get, get rolling. All right, good. So they're gonna, they're going down. These people, they're chopping. They should start moving to get that stuff. Yeah, there we go. There we go. Start getting that wood together while you're chopping. All right. So I think what I want to do is I want to build a structure around this, and it'll be our initial like structure and building thing. Maybe we'll see. So right now they're just kind of gathering the wood up so we just have a place to put it. And I'm gonna need to build something down there for all the animals we have. Oh good, they've, they've, been, they've been good down here. All right, let's look at what we can make off of this. I'm gonna need a three by three up here. So I'm gonna make one here. One of our first little structures there. I'll do the same thing over here for another workshop over here. Um, and yeah, I'm gonna put stairs. Once they're, I'll let them do some more. Good. I'm going to put some more stairs right here. And then more stairs going down. Basically, I just want to have access to the lower floors pretty quickly. Alright. So we... Alright. Once that's... Kind of good. Oh, there's water. Hmm, can I clear that? Oh, right, well, let's go ahead and finish it. All right, there we go. All right, now I want to build a workshop down here. A workshop. Let's see here. Get the carpenter to come down here. And we can build out of some 
of that. And build there. And I want to build an area over here for wood. Let's see. All right, so they're doing that. Oh, let's. All right, well, let's just see what they. Oh, good. This is all built. So I'll come here. Let's get some. We'll get some uh, doors. So I want to put doors here. Uh, I'll make a wooden door. Add new task. Eventually we'll make an office and stuff so we can make this a lot easier. But for right now, I just want to get a few things down. Let's add new task. And we'll make a bed. <clears throat> Let's make a table. Where's wooden table? Come on, wooden table. Uh, I'm sure I passed it. Probably, there it is. How did I miss that? I don't know. I'm gonna need another door. Alright, let's go. Alright. Now make another, I'll make another stockpile here. That's acceptable. We're gonna make it wood. There we go. Cool. So now people should be moving wood. Yeah, they'll just start moving that wood from there, down there. To put that stuff there. Wait, what? Nothing happened. There's water everywhere down here. Okay. Well, that's interesting. So let's just go here. Go down a level and see if that'll work. And here, I think I can... Is that how you get rid of it? Uh, how do you? Well, for now, I'll, I'll figure that out. Let's just go to see if they can mine that downwards. And what else? Let me see. Can I? Doors. Do we have any doors yet? I'd like to place a door here. Sweet, yeah. There we go. All right, good. And up here, I don't want another workshop, but a craft workshop. Yeah, because that's what we're going to be able to use to make stuff to sell for whatever someone gets here to. Yeah. So we'll put the craft one up there. Nice. And while we're doing that, let's go ahead and put 
the I want more doors. Yeah. Need more doors. Ooh, got a bed posted good. Uh let's see. I need another door. Oh, let's make a wooden chair. And a door. And here. It's not a new task. Let's, uh. Got plenty of wood. Make some wooden figurines. Uh, yeah, wood. Make another one. We'll add a third one. Let's go with, uh, a cup. Hmm, just keep Google. Some people busy. The hauling, and I don't need them to haul. I think that should do it, right? That, I think by doing that, that takes them out of that from hauling. I think. Don't quote me. Because as long as there's something in the hall, that will take precedence over other stuff, I think. Alright, and I need to have a I need to build a stockpile off of this. I'll put it here. I want to make it like right there. This will be for finished stuff. Good. All right. Holy crap. So this is all just water down here. Uh, okay. So I'm going to just have to build more hallway and let's link these two up Do there start building some bedrooms here probably not the most the and again I'm not a uh, I'm not a professional uh, at this game so so I'll probably be like, you're doing it wrong. You're going to get your dwarves killed. Uh, yeah, that's probably going to happen. I'm not trying to get them killed on purpose, but. All right, I'm going to put a stockpile here. Accept that, and let's see here. We'll make it custom. Uh, actually, finished goods. Let's just do custom. We'll do finished goods and all furniture right now. Yeah, that'll work. Okay, that's good. So furniture, let's get a bed. We got a bed there. Yep, cedar's fine. Oh, it needs a door. 
So we're gonna put a door down here. Essentially, I'm just trying to, what I wanna do is get a office set up so I can change my guy into a manager so that they can, that'll open up some things for when we're crafting. So let's see here, let's put a door here. And I want a door there. Is that a chair? Okay. That's gonna go in the office area. Let's get some furniture. Uh, do I have a table? Sweet, yeah. And then I want a chair. All right, so now we can designate a bedroom. Oh, is, all right. What does multi mean? All right, so that's not a bedroom. And then I want a office. All right, so there's that, and now I can, I can go here and make my manager, what's my expedition leader? So that should unlock, work orders, yes! Okay, so now we can do work orders. So now, I just move to this shop. All right, so what do I want? six beds and I need six more bedrooms so I need six doors uh, that's fine uh, well no. let's just make make what we need for right now I need yeah, six more All right, it's coming along. So, I think... Let's go here. So if there's water below us, can I make a well? So before we end this, I want to make sure that we also have food and water. Ooh. Yeah, this is right there. And they can go down because there's freaking water. Four, five. She's already in there. Oh, right there. Perfect. So I'll build one more here just as a spare. All 
All right, and that should be good. I think that's where we'll end it. So we didn't get a whole lot done. We're, we're working on the bedrooms and it's a little bit slower. I'm getting the hang of this. I had to watch a tutorial. Like I did a tutorial, but the tutorial isn't that great because it doesn't tell you like how to make food or anything, but I did watch and it kind of gave me a better rundown of that. What I want to do eventually, we're going to put doors on all these that we'll have each of the doors will have a bedroom and then we'll, we'll, we won't have to assign them, they'll assign themselves. I mainly wanted to sign this one because I want to make sure that they had a bedroom and that we have the office. Because once you have this, and you unlock where you can do work orders here. So our, our next episode, I think we're gonna we're gonna delve into getting our food production started, um, and we gotta figure what to do with all this water. Um, you still people have people sitting around, but not a lot of them. I think just like this person. Once we can get some food going, they'll be doing that. And like, oh man, there's so much wood up here that we have. It's, Fisher Dwarf, I don't know what you're doing, but uh, I hope you enjoy it. Uh, I know it's a little bit slower game, but it's, I'm still figuring it out. And uh, hopefully by adding people to it, like their names, like we have Papa Gray and uh, Deep Bro running around. I'm sure they're doing stuff. So hopefully they don't die. And uh, oh, we got a, we got, oh, we have llamas or alpacas. Nice. But either way, uh, thanks for coming out and uh, Subscribe if you want to see more. Um, I'm really interested in, in Dwarf Fortress. I've heard about it a lot. Um, I like Rim World. I also like playing Rim World where it's more like medieval. And since it's all just medieval anyway, it's kind of interesting. It's a very different kind of game. It doesn't really hold your hand, but it is rewarding and fun. And I do like building. So uh, hopefully you're enjoying that. And uh, I'll talk to you guys later. See ya.